trying to write air conditioner repair 500 times without it being duplicate. Like, that's just a bad job. Because <laughs> the content has to be unique. So it takes an army. Most people that have done business with us, we just had a gentleman that was in the class before. He said he had at least 20 people on his website project. That's real. It's about how many people. You need like 5% of 40 people's expertise, not one. I've had people that have attended. Gentleman brought his marketing rep. Marketing person can't do this. If you have an internal marketing person, that person's job is a digital asset manager. Their job is to grab all the stuff out of your head, all the things you have for the company, to have the tribal knowledge, to know the weather, to know the products, to know the seasons, to know when you bring on a new product, new, new staff, something, and to get it to the marketing people and the nerds that know how to distribute it and get it out there. That's their job, they're intermediaries. All right, so website number one. <coughs> Did I show you guys a website yet? No? no? Oh, forget about this thing. Okay. So, how about this? We'll go to Mr. Certified. What you'll notice about the sites, they gotta look good. Who you are, what you do, where you do it, how to reach you, all have to be top, above. <coughs> Don't make people search. When I talked about the different kinds of reviews, this button is specifically to capture reviews that showcase on a search result where I showed you the reviews under the listing, okay? Which is different than other kinds of reviews. CRM system, the ability to take payments, maintenance, maintenance agreements, take payments online, maintenance agreements. As you go down, the site's gotta look more like a magazine when you first get there not like a bunch of messy content or something somebody's got to read. It's got to look, look good. From a graphic standpoint, call to actions, how are you converting them? Needs to be dynamic, video, photo, auto, audio, and so forth, all the way down to the bottom when you get into the logistics of a site. Need you to remember this. There is no such thing as a completed website. That does not exist. There is no such thing as a perfect website. That does not exist. I can rip any website to shreds whether we built it or someone else did. Does not matter. If you try and focus on it being perfect, by the time you even get close, the requirements will change and it will be old and no longer work. Okay? You need to have a critical eye. These, let me see if I have this. Did I show you guys this yet? <laughs> what happens when you don't use the PowerPoint? So, Google has announced some of the major initiatives for 2018. Number one initiative, voice search. Right now, um, the latest statistics said that 71% of adults are utilizing a voice search, which is Siri. Siri. Google Home, Echo, Alexa, Siri, Bixby, and so forth. Here's the thing. A voice search doesn't bring you to the internet with those 10 listings on your website. Voice searches display local directories, Google Maps. So you, all the work you have on your website, when someone does the search and they talk to one of these things, a, the query is different. Somebody says, hey, Google, find me an air conditioning repair company with the best reviews in Edmonds, Washington. That's a different query than you would put into Google if you typed it, right? So that's a different set of data it's looking for. And your website has no value. If 71% of adults are now voice querying their searches, and that's expected to increase by 130%, is your website the number one most important thing right now? These pieces of paper, you guys got the last 60 copies. We got to redo it this year. Okay? We just have to redo the order, the priority. Mobile first. Google's new requirement, it's not about a website being mobile responsive anymore. By the way, when somebody builds you a website, if they do it right, they don't build you one. They build you about 80. 
They have to have a website for every size device that has to display on uh, Android, on an iPhone, has to display on a 6-inch tablet, 7-inch tablet, 10-inch tablet, 11-inch tablet, 12-inch tablet, big screen, little screen, whatever. Refrigerator, tables, now, now we got to have it work in a hotel bathroom window, <laughs> okay? In addition, every search engine has a different requirement. For those that still use Internet Explorer, you carry a BlackBerry. Just kidding. <laughs> Internet Explorer has different requirements than Firefox, different requirements than Bing, different requirements than Google Chrome. So you're never having one website built. It's not an easy process. It's like <coughs> starting a company. If you know it's going to be hard, buckle down, bear through it, get through it, and have a smile on your face the whole time. And like my kids' gym sign, show up, sit up, and participate. If you hire a company like ours and you say, well, you guys, all you, you know HVAC. Just do it. Fine. And you can look like every other HVAC company out there. What a marketing company should do is drag out of you how you're different. <laughs> drag it. <laughs> like reach into your soul and pull it out. I don't need you to taste like chicken. <laughs> I don't want it to look like everything else. I don't want it to sound like everything else. It has to have something different. Okay? So you got to participate. I know you don't want to, and every excuse in the book, I get it. You got to participate. PHP 7, no, I'm not even going to go through all these. These are all the requirements that are heavy hitters this year, which means everything we launched last year. <laughs> I love our business. Okay, so don't your your world's not bad, right? It needs maintenance. You got to keep working at it. It's not a project; it's a lifestyle. So, second, content. Every page on your site get you into a new drawer. Here's how easy it is. <laughs> what do you want to sell? Where do you want to sell it? Page of content, Google can crawl. Inside a great website. Make it popular so it moves up to where? Page what? First page of Google, where people are looking. Now you have a cash machine. What do you want to sell? Where do you want to sell it? So it's not just AC repair, it's AC repair, air conditioner repair, air conditioning repair. In every city you want to do business in, heat, heater. it's not just heat and heater, you know what it's not, it's not cooling. Furnace. Cooling repair is not a certain term actual people use, you guys use that. If you're from Chicago, it's furnace installation. If you're from California, a furnace is something in Freddy Krueger's basement. It's not real. Okay? They don't say furnace in California, and they don't say heater in Chicago, and people move. <laughs> so both are important. Had a gentleman, he was like, I was at Spoken California, he was sitting in the class and he was itching, wanting to tell me something. Finally a break comes and he was like, I have a page on my website and I don't even sell this and I don't know why I tear it. Rah, rah. He, like, I was like, okay, first you have to calm down. Second, what is it? And he was like, geothermal. We can't do geothermal here. There's clay and this and that and everything else. And I was like, okay, relax. Why is this such a big deal right now? He was like, I don't even know how it got there. And I was like, okay, well, what happened? He said, well, I just took three calls while you were talking. This is our client. It's like, awesome. So when you took the call, did you tell him why they can't have geothermal? He was like, yeah. It's like, did you tell him what they can't have? He said, yeah. I said, did you set the appointment? He was like, well, yeah. Never mind. Keep the content. He didn't sell geothermal, but he had a page generating a ton of business for him, didn't know it, and was angry that the content was there because it's not something he sells. But if that's what the customer is looking for, why not give them an opportunity to find you because you have what they're looking for and to convince them they need something different? Does that make sense? Okay. It's not just the basics. These are the basics. If you're in California, California, you have weird kind of things you can put in air conditioning and heating in. Distilleries, wine cellars, wine shops, what else? Dispensaries. I said dispensaries, I gave my version. Okay, that's Washington, that's California. I got a whole bunch of states that can do that. If you're sitting in Washington state, Ductless air conditioner installation, that's one thing. If you are near the water, 
houseboat air conditioner installation, vessel in air conditioner installation, floating home air conditioner installation. If you're sitting next to a major medical facility, you have medical office air conditioner installation. Next to a school, next to an airport, think about how consumers search. If you want to get found for it, all you need is a page of content. We make it popular, move it to the front of Google, and now you have a what? Cash. cash machine. The more cash machines you have, the more what you have? Time. time. The more time you have, the more what you have? Back to square one. It's all connected. Making sense? Okay. So, I'm on step two. <laughs> I'm going to skip CRM. We'll come back to that. Actually, uh, one, one small thing. If you're using QuickBooks to house your data, no. In the future, you're going to want to be able to send text messages, email marketing, be able to shoot out a message like this because you got trucks in the driveway, you want to do a promotion, get everybody working, busy. If the data is not in a system where you can easily do that, later you're going to wish you would have. So our clients, every one of them, have a CRM attached to their it's a contact relationship management system. You'll notice every one of them has this. Online scheduling, CRM, forms. Um, you can do email marketing. You can do text message marketing. Our clients will be with us for two years before they will use all the stuff that's in there, and that's fine because it's a lot. 